guys. Hi guys. So today I'm going to be making I'm going to be making a video with my voice and I'm showing you how to make how I make my thumbnails. So the first thing you want to do is go to a background like in a house or something that is easy to be like erased almost. So yeah, I'm going to go to one of the free builders. So yeah. And then you may have seen my video of the um, morning routine of a dentist. So yeah, and I kind of just put them like right here. And this is just the dentist. I'm going to kind of be recreating that. So yeah, I just get that and I screenshot it. And then what I do is if I want any like, say I want a toothbrush because it's a dentist, I also do that one and I screenshot that. So yeah, now after I've done that, I screenshot the place I wanted at. So let's go to the dentist so I can show you that where I want to screenshot that. Okay, so I'm going to the dentist. So here's the dentist and I'm gonna go into it so I can take a screenshot of that and blur it for the background. Okay, so I'm in the dentist and I could always take more pictures, screenshots. Say once, because it's the dentist, I also take a screenshot of this. So then, yeah, I do that. And I like to remove any characters. I, there's no characters here. And like clean it up a little. And then I take a screenshot of the area. Now I'm gonna go to my home screen. And I'm going to, go to because the app I use to crop in background areas isn't as good for cropping. So I go to photos and I just um, crop out all the stuff around it. So yeah. Okay, so I had to turn the phone the other way and I didn't want it to mess it up. So yeah, now I crop the toothbrush mostly and then I'm gonna crop, I would crop something else, but just to save time, I'm not gonna crop anything else. So then I use an iOS or an Android, I don't know what you call it. So I have this background eraser app. You can always use a different background eraser app, but I have one. And sorry, I'm gonna confuse you guys, but I need to turn the phone this way. So I go to it and I hit load a photo and I first I need to get my character and I'm just gonna crop him I didn't crop him in my photos because he's bigger so yeah I cropped him now first I auto and I do the walls because auto is easier and then I do magic and I do around him and I need to do whoa so yeah I do that and I kind of crop around him there's areas I cannot get like doing it this way so I just do it like this and I kind of use manual which sometimes it doesn't look the best but yeah so that's what you have to do okay I'm done with that so I'm just gonna hit down and look at that but sometimes you want to just fix it up a little if it doesn't look um, as good so yeah I'm just fixing this part up the edges Okay, so yeah, now I do that. But there's still some white space, so I just keep cleaning it, trying to do it right. Okay, so that's good. I get to finish, because I use PixArt, but I don't like using PixArt to do this. Um, so yeah. Then I do, just, I can just do magic for this, and wait, manual for this. I mean, yeah, auto for this. And then there. And I hit save. And finish. Now that I got that, and um, I'm going to go to Pixart, and I'm actually going to turn back. back so, a second. Yeah, okay, there we go. So Pixart takes a second to load. There we go. Okay, yeah. So it takes a second to load, and I don't have the premium, so. Okay, it's the add button, and I hit. Which one I want to blur? So this one. And then I don't need to adjust the like, to do like 16, 9 thingy. It just automatically does it. And I go to FX or effects. Yeah, effects, yeah. So and I hit blur and I can always adjust if I want a little more blurry or not. But I like just doing it like, like that. And then I hit, where is it? Add photo. And I add these to the ones that I cut out and I make them bigger. So I can 
just pretend I'd add more. And then I would hit text and that do um morning routine of a dentist. Morning routine of a dentist. It already has it in the text I've already wrote in this. So I hit down. But I don't want the color. So yeah, I'm gonna make that a little bigger. And I'm going to hit color. And I'm just going to change the color. You can always keep it the same color. But I want mine teal. So yeah. And then move it around. And there we go. And then I just hit save. And it saves my photo gallery. So thanks for watching. Bye. And tell me this. Tell me if this is helpful to you guys in the comments. Bye.